What the hell did I do with my phone? Half a pizza. I got the rest of the money, did you? Can you hear me now? We'll be back within 13 to 15. Come on, Mike, let's go. Where's your little sister to get back? She left 10 minutes ago. She can walk in any minute. She can walk in two hours. And she said, kitty cat. Straight up goddamn lying. <laughs> Ain't no goddamn kitty in her ass. Two minutes of dope time, maybe two hours. They got no concept of time. They say five minutes to keep you there. Keep their money coming in. Cause it's dope time. And you're dope sick and you ain't going nowhere. Guaranteed. You're waiting sub-zero weather in the alley, on top of the roof, under a car. Anybody else, 24 hours a day, seven days a week? That's American time and world time. Dope time is eight days a week, 369 days in a year, and 53, year, 53 weeks in a year. You never know what time you're gonna get your shit. Today, tomorrow, have to get your shit, and somebody wait. <laughs> hey, what's going on? Sorry it was a little longer than, you know, the minutes. <laughs> well, oh, what's up, Mike Mike? Let that shit make the world go around. <laughs> this is the money-making fool. It fill up penitentiaries, <laughs> it make kids cry, it make daddies and mama live each other. It one, <laughs> one that up for show. It's gonna be here when we all go. <laughs> and these are they friends. Get your ass out of here, boy. Jimmy God. You came on to the dope uh -huh. Take care of your brother. <laughs> everybody in our family plate. eats. Oh, okay. Yeah, everybody here eats, so. One eat, we all eat. Like the Matrix. Plug in. Pipe in your mouth and you hit it. See you about 20 minutes when you get back. You know, crack goes back to when man decides not to be man, he want to be somebody else. So he altered his mind. Bonnie Clyde had liquor. Cowboys had their weed, they call it peace pipe. Came here, had fire. It's real. So they want a trip, they pull some shit. NASA got the astronauts. <laughs> Little kids got candy. Everybody tripping. You know, anything can happen, it's too <laughs> Anything. So strap up and lace up and get ready for the ride. <laughs> Hi there. What's up, guys? Hey. Here's the, the lady of the hour here. She knows how to make money. She knows how to make friends. She knows how to be a family. Wow. And she tries to keep everybody as a family. Uh, uh, she's hard on everybody <laughs> because she believes so much that even though we're we're uh, prostitutes, drug addicts, whatever we are, it, we're still a family. And we're still people. And we're still people. Yeah. And we don't have to be less than that. Yeah, she does believe that. Yeah, she does. So you didn't disrespect me by not telling me that you took that you owe my man ten dollars? I didn't even. All right, maybe yeah, in a way. But I thought when you said take care of business, that. What, did she think it's okay to borrow money from oh, my dude? No, I, I just assumed that you we were taking care of business. Get your fucking ass dressed and go get the fucking money. Whether it's $2, $3, or $5. I'm getting ready to go out and see if I can find somebody with some money so I can come back and repay part of my debt. And then my day begins, and it's what time? 11, 11.30 at night? This is my day. Vampires come out at night. <laughs> Oh, shut up! I love this. Hey, man, bitch ass shit and motherfucking say shit, man. You come in here and you let every motherfucking body know that the police is out there and they stopped you. What the fuck is wrong with you, man? Are you gonna admit what you said to them, Laura? I don't know what. No, I, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. You want to stand up or you want to sit down so I can refresh your memory? It's going to be your choice right now. Do you recall the day the at the caravan that I slapped you in the mouth? I'm going to beat your motherfucking ass down. So it's going to be your choice. Cut me off for listening to your choice. Okay? I'm up here. Okay, I know. And you got an audience. That's and fucking right. Camera. You know what, DJs? Can y'all motherfucking excuse me? Cause you said fucking Terry's name. Didn't you? Did 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 you? Did
know, that's another thing that you know is going to happen every day. Different, you know, person, different face, but the same story. The, I know, the high for me on crack is like the person I used to be, but then when I get, it comes down, then I'm back to the person I didn't ever, I don't want to be. Everybody wants to feel like they belong somewhere. Whether you're on drugs or you're not on drugs, you just want to feel like you know, you're somebody. Basically, they're all good people. They just got lost somewhere. And it's sad because, you know, society looks at them like, you know, you're no good, you're a drug addict. Ah, you know, and most of them are very intelligent. And, you know, they have a lot going for them. They just an addict, you know, we can't, sometimes you just can't help, you know, that you become an addict. You don't want to, you just say, oh, when I grow up, I'm going to be a heroin addict, I'm going to grow up, I'm going to be a crack user. It just happens. And I would try to change people's, that's the thing, try to change people's view on homeless people and people that use drugs because, you know, they do have a heart and they do have feelings. And people don't treat them like that. They treat them like they're, uh, you know, like not even an animal, because people treat animals even better, you know. So the prostitutes and that, they're not wanting to go out there and do that, you know. They're not happy about it. They come back, a lot of them cry, you know, and go through a lot of emotions, and they have to get high to do it, <laughs> you know. <laughs> so. We, we, all live, we all live in different lives in our own way, but some way in the we all blend back together by the end of the day.